All right, the plan for today is hopefully to get Billy Rayner's pen done so that we can turn them out into a bigger area for winter. Mommy, could you hold these boats? Can you hold these or not? Thank you. What if he needs my help holding the panel? Okay, I'll go down. No, I got him. Okay, in case you... Oh, shit. You need me to hold that? I was trying to get it into the other one here, too. You have owned that. Why don't you need another one if you already own it? All right. Sorry for my appearance. I just woke up. It's Sunday now. And I didn't get very much footage yesterday because it was 91 degrees or something like that. It was super hot for the last day of September and we did not get the boys pen done. So they're not going out into that yet. We are hoping we can maybe work on it today, but it's supposed to be like 90 degrees. So still really hot. So I'm getting ready for the day and we're just going to see how hot it is. We're going to try to do a little bit before it gets too hot. But we also have some exciting things coming this week because we are watching a horse sale on Thursday, Friday, because we are hoping to get the kids a pony that they can kind of handle on their own because Zoe's been showing a lot of interest with riding more on her own. And none of our horses are really well broke enough for that. So we're looking for a pony that's maybe more her size because she's also kind of afraid of heights. So, I will take you guys along for that, too, hopefully. But, yeah, basically, that's, that's kind of the plan. So, we'll see what we can get done today. Also, guys, if you haven't tried these mini powdered donuts from Aldi's, they're really good. I try not to eat them too much because they're not that healthy, but they're super good. Mark and his pony. No today. Four-year-old Mustang. And she's Mark's, Mark's girl. She really likes him. We put rocks down here, right in front of the water tank. We have kind of an issue sometimes that if it gets wet from rain or whatever, if we ever get rain again, which hopefully we do, it can get slick and icy and it gets muddy and we don't want a pulling muscle. So we put this rock down It'll help chip off their feet, which is never a bad thing. But uh, hopefully it'll make it so it doesn't get icy so quick and it won't get so muddy so they don't pull muscles in their legs because we, in the, well, in the spring when it's, but you got to move things now before they freeze to the ground. So anyway, so we put rock here, put rock up top. We're going to put the two reservation boys in a bigger pen where they can get on rock. Also, let them move around a little bit more and we'll see because we're, we're going to want to geld them before we turn them out with all these mares so that's the thought yep there's mark there's mark and nova she's a good horse mm -hmm. i'm glad i got her so i mean don't get me wrong i'll give her treats from time to time but I'm glad I've gotten to the point where... She comes for scratches, which yeah. is good. She likes scratches. I'd much rather have wanted her to be like that instead of treat over it. Well... Yeah, come here. Look, does it? I mean... I mean... Sorry for my appearance. This is my regular work day. 
Look, <laughs> I don't typically wear contacts. So my plan is I'm hoping that my husband, when he gets off, will get some clips of some of the things he's doing, but this is my biggest work day. So typically most of the day I'm just on my computer working, not doing anything interesting. I did get Duncan this morning, so I have that. So I'm drinking that and I'm hoping at some point we can, I can talk to you guys and explain more about the pony, but that's basically my entire Monday plan because that's typically what I do on a Monday. So I will put any other clips I get after this of what my husband's doing on a Monday. All right guys, it's Tuesday. I literally haven't vlogged like at all today because I didn't think I'd have that much work and then I ended up having quite a bit of work to do. So I just didn't get around to filming a whole lot, but I think I'm gonna gather my brushes up because I wanna get those cleaned before winter. And I'll probably spray out my grooming tote too because that had a huge spider in it and I just, I, ugh. I don't like, I don't like spiders very much. So I'm going to clean both my brushes and my grooming tote out. And I would film the whole thing. I can try to film it a little, but it's like super windy today. So I won't be able to film a whole lot. Also, I wanted to say about the ponies, I have been doing a lot of research into them and I've narrowed it down to a few I am super interested in, so we will see if any of those work out. That's on Friday, it's Tuesday. Tomorrow I have a doctor's appointment and then Thursday is one part of the sale and Friday is the part that has the ponies, so that's what we'll be watching. Very excited. I feel really good about these ponies, so we will see if they, or we will see if we get anything. I'm very excited. We're just gonna put my dirty brushes in this bucket because this bucket needs clean anyway. This is a bunch of my stuff from my coat. A lot of it which needs cleaned. I need to get a container for these because the little tag doesn't. Oh, it's tech. So we're going to put the dirty brushes in, in here so that I can clean them, so that I can use them. And I'm pretty sure I'm missing some. I don't know where they went. Some of these I think are wood back, so we're going to have to wash those differently. Also, the girls' grooming totes got, like, messed up, so... They're kind of just using mine. I'm hoping to get them a better one. Although, I don't even know if I like mine. I'll show you guys my tote. Alright, here's my grooming tote. And it's like, you can see, it's it's dirty. It's cobwebby. Because spiders build cobwebs in like an hour. I swear. Anyway, so this is my the grooming tote I currently use. And it has a thing so that dirt drops out of it or whatever. But... I got it from Big D Saddlery, and I like it, but it gets kind of heavy for me. 
So I don't know if I want to get something else or what I want to do. If you guys have any good grooming tote recommendations, put them down below because I'm not opposed to trying something different. I also really want to try like the, I think the brands like Harry Pony. I really want to try their brushes, but that's going to be like a splurge for me. So I'm waiting till, I don't know, maybe next year or something. I'll try them out. But if you have any other good recommendations, put, put them all down below. I'll read them. All right, I got them soaking and we will see how they turn out. I gotta flip these over if I can, but we'll see how clean I can get them. I think they came out pretty clean. Except this one. All right, it's Thursday now, and the first auction is going on today, so I'm kind of just watching it to kind of get an idea of prices, although these are more like heavier weight horses, you know, draft horses. And there is some halflingers, but the horses, well, the ponies are selling tomorrow, so I'm more interested in that sale, but I'm kind of just getting an idea of what prices are going for. So that's what we're going to do today. And I haven't got a lot of filming done this week, so I don't know how long this weekly vlog is going to be. But I've had quite the week. Yesterday I did my blood glucose test, and I also had to get my Tdap shot, so my left arm is quite sore. So I didn't really do anything yesterday. I didn't even get like any clips after my doctor's appointment, so it's just like... What is this random clip before your doctor's appointment? And then nothing, nothing happened. We did get the, um, where am I going with this? The reservation boys, um, Billy and Raider. They are, we're almost done with their pen. So they are over there right now and they're just loving it. So I do have a clip of them running around. We'll see what I get today, because I'm watching auction most of the day, but I might get a few clips later this evening. So we'll see how it goes, and I'm really excited for tomorrow, but we'll see how Thursday's auction kind of goes to see if tomorrow's going to be good. Right now we are going to make go make a coffee, though, because I need to wake up. I'm like half asleep trying to watch this, and I need some coffee. All right, guys, it's Friday, it's sale day, and I'm pretty excited, and I feel really good, and I think we're definitely going to get something today, but we will definitely keep you posted if we do. The prices were decent yesterday, so 
we'll see what they are today and hopefully we're bringing home a pony later today but we will definitely keep you posted so we didn't get a pony the prices were i don't know way higher way higher than expected higher than i would have thought for most of the area being in a drought um but i think there was only maybe a few that uh bigger horses i would say that went for pretty cheap that may have gone to a kill pen yeah or a kill buyer um but otherwise i say everybody got a home on average the ponies were going for what three to five thousand dollars yeah for like mini pony so so wasn't in our budget for right now and no. the one pony i could have afforded i had an audio issue so we won't talk about it <laughs> So instead we're going to unbox my forelock and fringe, you can't even see it, my forelock and fringe box. That's in everything, that's the pull card. Oh look what the sneak peek is for next month, wait, sneak peek for next month, is that a sweatshirt or a long sleeve shirt? I don't know, which one? Ethel. Uh, that's a sweatshirt, is that a sweatshirt? That's a sweatshirt. That's nice. That's kind of nice. All right, we got this scarf, David. Let's take this out of here. All right. This is by the same brand that did the halter. Wait, focus. Except this is like the fashion. Yeah. And is that the price for uh, yeah. in the U.S.? U.S. price is twenty four ninety nine for this scarf. That's a nice scarf. Get it out of here. Mm. I don't know. Very soft. Oops, careful. Oh my god. It's like a whole blanket. Oh, there we go. Yeah. There it is. I think that looks pretty nice, doesn't yeah. it? There. Probably a little hot for right now, though. Maybe tomorrow. Give it a few <laughs> weeks. Yeah, a day or two. Okay, let's see. Let us see it. We got... Oh, this is that brand that did the fly spray too. Red Horse Products. We got Focus. It's not focusing. Focus. Some Soul Cleanse. Twelve forty nine. $12.49. What about this? We got this little... That is a rubber magnetic massager. How much is it? It oh, is whatever is six, retail. Six dollars and twenty four cents. Seems awful cheap. <laughs> well they can't have all expensive things. We got this Lincoln Himalayan Lincoln salt. salt Look. Lick. And is, that is, that's a good size what one. What is this? How big is that one? I don't know what a kilogram is. And it uh, well the price is five sixty three. What's a kilogram to a pound? I don't know, I'd have to look it up. Let's look it up. Everybody probably already knows. One kilogram, two pounds. 2.205 pounds. You could have just put it on a scale. But I can also <laughs> Google it. And we got these gloves. Those are... What's the brand? E. Oh. E oh, E Quest. E Quest think... winter waterproof gloves. I think that's who. Best seller. That's who did the summer gloves. Let's see. I don't know. Those look like they're gonna be nice. Uh, retail for them is twenty-seven forty-nine. Ooh. Ooh. I dropped something. Okay. Oh. I feel this. Ooh. Ooh. Are they warm? I would say, yeah. Well, good. When you do chores tomorrow, you can take oh, them Oh, you know out what? We you. have this, too. That is a... They call it from Bramble Foods. It's Flapjack. What's a Flapjack, though? Like... Well, well like, for us, it'd be a pancake. But, but it looks like a brownie. Us, it almost looks like a... Like a... Like a... A 
like a cereal bar or something. Let's taste it's it. How do we open it? So now you open everything else. It's not opening. Okay, here we go. Right, it. Does it smell good? Um, it smells interesting. It kind of smells like a cereal here, bar. Break a piece off. Yeah, it does. Like a breakfast bar type thing. Like a gran like a granola bar. Mm-hmm. Hmm. It tastes like a granola bar, but it's soft like It's real soft. Almost like a pancake soft. But there's oatmeal in there. Mm-hmm. It's not bad. Like a breakfasty dessert. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Is that everything? Yeah, oh, we got a coupon. Oh, what is this? This is like a whole catalog. Mm. Oh, they talk about... Oh, yeah, it's like a catalog. This is like for show clothes. <laughs> or nicer. <laughs> Nicer clothes than what I ride in. Oh, these are the... Those are the socks we got last time. Oh, neat. Okay, it's like a little catalog. I like these halters. Oh, they're padded. Oh my gosh, I love this. This little... Zoe, would, Zoe would love mm. that. For her not... Her non-existent pony that yeah. we haven't gotten. Now we used to get the what Cavalli Club. Yeah. And it doesn't sound like their boxes lately have been that good, but I'm kind of glad we kept going with the Forlock and Cringe. I can't wait to get the um, Advent Calendar. Advent Calendar. I want to see that. I want to try the Moringa box again sometime. Mm. And then we got a coupon. Maybe we, maybe we can do that in the spring. Yeah. I'll have some good stuff, maybe. For the winter. Yeah. I hear they're supposed to have slippers. <laughs> of course, you need another pair of them. So. We'll keep you guys up to date on our hunt yeah, for a pony. Are you going to put the link for to for Forlock and Fringe in case they want to order it? Yeah, I can and put the, the link link down below for this box, but. And that, yeah. It's, price-wise, for it to be shipped overseas is not... Yeah. Not bad at all. Um, definitely takes a little longer to go through customs, but Still it's, it's worth it. Yeah. So. And you get a snack. Mm-hmm. So we'll, get, we'll keep you guys updated on the uh, pony hunt, and hopefully we've watched like three, four sales now, so. Yeah, there's some that we normally would watch too online, but they're not doing it this time around here. So I think what there's one coming up maybe the end of October. Yeah. So we'll just wait and see. Yeah. So we'll see you guys Later. in our next yeah whenever video. <laughs> Bye. Bye.